people, like pretty far to get to these uh, to these tournaments, yeah, these regionals, internationals. I used to live in Seattle, and uh, my family was always on the East Coast, so whenever I came back for holidays and stuff, it was brutal. That flight, I mean, it's five hours either way, and you gain two hours coming, but you lose three hours going. Yeah, so it's not it's a fun not flight fun at, all. at all. You know, I honestly, I don't know how the Europeans coming over here to compete can do it. Like, it, yeah, it's. I mean, their flights are long. I heard somebody ask Armada about his flight. He was like, it wasn't that bad. But from the time I got on the plane, it was only 11 hours. I was like, <laughs> yeah. really, Armada? <laughs> really? Like, only that's, 11 that's hours. Bad, so they're actually striking just on the stage list. Yeah. Make it simpler for themselves. Looks like they're going to go down to Dreamland. Korean DJ making it to Losers Finals after his loss to Mango. Oh. He started in Loser's Final that they lost yeah. an angle in Winner's Final. So Flo making it all the way to the Loser's Bracket. Korean DJ going for that quick give. Doesn't quite get it though. Yeah, unfortunately. He gets burned by the Foxfire. It's nice to see Korean DJ picking up the Sheik. Yeah, absolutely. This is what he's known for is his Sheik. It's yeah. a very creative Sheik style. Yeah, his Sheik was so fast and so powerful back in the MLG days. And uh, was arguably like one of the best chicks in the world back then. Yeah, so like, let's see what he pulls out against SS Flow. The metagame has changed quite a bit though, and this matchup has gotten worse for Sheik. It's always been even-ish, but yeah. Fox has developed so many more tools to deal with Sheik now. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, every single one of Fox's matchups has gotten more in his favor <laughs> over the years. Yeah. So, oh, very fair to get uh, yeah. Fox off the ledge. But gets down smashed. Flo is able to get the first stock with that Shakira percent, 69. Gets a grab. Shout out to DJ Nintendo. He loves that percentage. Oh, great fair by Korean DJ. Trading with the get up attack and takes the ledge. And oh, that's good. the end of SS Flow's first stock. Set this back to basically even here. The Approaching SS with that down tilt. Yeah. That's, a, that's a surprisingly good approach. It pops him right up into the air and he gets some prime for Fox combos. Yep, and it has such great range that like you almost always made a reaction out of them. They think they can do something about it, but they really can't. You gotta wave dash out of shield to catch it. So he's doing very well against Korean DJ. Hasn't let go of the lead since the beginning of the match. This Fox is playing very clean right now. Alright, gets him with that upbeat hitbox. Can he capitalize? Oof. Nice. Smash. Needle, needle just barely misses. Barely misses. Yep. Nice angle there. He tried to catch him with the up tilt, but the angle wouldn't have it. Uh, oh. Lo could be a little bit more consistent with these edge guards. He'd be in a much better position this match. But it looks like he's going to be able to close out this stock. Yep, that's going to be it. And he has a slight lead on Korean DJ right now. Uh, Flo trying to use the invincibility on the shine there to avoid the down smash. But the down smash also has invincibility and multiple hitboxes, so it is able to beat out the shine when they both. When the invincibility clanks on the two of them. Korean I'm just a crouch cancel it down, smash. Yep. Uh, Barely misses that back air. It's one of her more powerful knockback tools on the ground. Uh, her air one obviously being her forward air attack. Um, if you can't get the opponent airborne with a dash attack or a forward tilt, down smash is almost always like a good surprise. Okay, I like the back air. You know she's not gonna die. All right, a better response punished. would have been wave shine to up smash. <laughs> but, uh, All right, guys, it sounds like KDJ is actually not playing Sheik in this one. It sounds like he's actually the oh, Fox player. Oh, okay. <laughs> that makes a lot more sense now. Well, I mean, not a lot more sense. Flo's obviously keeping the match close. Yeah. Uh, I mean, they were both playing really good. So it was, uh, I mean, DJ just plays too many characters. Can't blame those yeah, guys. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> he's got a uh, Fox, a Sheik, and a Marth. Yeah, definitely. And he plays red, always, so it's a little bit confusing there. That's true. All right, bro, well, well, aside from that uh, little flub we got. Ooh. Ooh. Oh! He got the stock, though. So just like that, it's an even game. Yep, 27 so to 0. Basically, everything we said about who's winning and momentum is exactly the same. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, it's just Korean DJ doing the kicks and Flo doing the slaps. Really nice recovery right there. Great combo by Korean DJ. Oh, nice back air. Sneaky back air on the landing leg. With the ledge, he's gonna, uh, yep. He's got that punish, he's gonna keep Sheik off stage and recovering onto the stage as much as he can. Ooh, that was, <laughs> that, that was, was, was kind of rude. <laughs> it was a, it was <laughs> a little, was bit a little rude. bit rude. <laughs> but Korean DJ does take game one. 
I'm surprised as someone who main streak for so long and uh, has been such a top contender in this game that he messed up so many edge guards on this shit. Yeah. Uh, he did clean it up a little bit towards the end. That little disrespectful of Smash. But let's see what Flo does differently. He wants a salty run back. He took it back to Dreamland. Let's see what he can do here. That's his Flo, uh, that's his crew actually made it out to ROM. And they didn't do too well, but you know, shout outs to them supporting all, all our majors here on the East Coast. You know, they're doing a great job down there in the South. And oh, Ooh, very nice, very nice. Speaking of edge guards, Korean DJ. You gotta, like, be, you gotta be really quick to make that edge guard, too. Yep. She's uh, up B has a slight bit of vulnerability at the start of it. So if you can catch her in the initial pop up of it, uh, you can easily get her. Because she needs momentum to get like all the way back. And it seems like a big window, but it's really not because Fox has to get out there to do it. Yep, definitely. See, Ooh, oh, see again, there it was again. again. He used the B to try to sweet spot the ledge. Karina J was just not having it. Karina J looking dash. much more dominant in this game. Yeah, playing uh, much more consistently. Oh! 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 Six on the beach. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> For lack of a better word. <laughs> that was amazing plays. Reflected the needle to push her down, then shined her. Great play by Korean DJ. Yeah, his pressure is all these All these pressures. Going for the wall kick shine again. Doesn't get him, but gets the up B. Tries to combo out of it. Chains with the back air. Trying to turn around ledge hog. Getting Flo back off the Ooh. stage. Ooh. Barely misses the up smash, but yeah. he's going to get another chance at it right here. Still at, yeah, still at an advantage even after that. Goes for the back air instead of the up air. Didn't want to risk to smash the eye. Just took the, the oh. guarantee damage. I'll kick her again if she comes back. It's it a looks good like, mentality uh, to have. Flo wanted to... Uh, he probably thought Korean DJ was going to jump back on the stage since that's the option he's picked so many times. Yep. Uh, a good technique if you want to use that type of recovery as Sheik is to use the, the initial pop of the up B to move backwards. And then the other player will think you're going over the ledge because you're moving at an awkward angle. And yeah. then they get off and you actually just teleport straight forward and grab the ledge. And it's a technique com commonly used by Mewtwo Kick. Let's see if he goes for the wave shine here. Oh, no. Just, nope, just goes for the uh, tech chase read. He's getting them, so can't fault them. Oh, tries to go for it again. There. And oh, almost enough the eye. And a JV4 stop for Korean DJ after that very, very close initial game.